Welcome to the Average Rook. We are still playing The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. I've decided that we're going to continue with Count Reuven's treasure. We'll just deal with this and then we'll move on to the main quests. So, meet Triss at the Eternal Fire Shrine near the harbor around midnight. So, where is this shrine? It's all the way over here. We could use the High Rock Square and then, um, or we could just walk over to it and then wait until midnight. That's probably what we'll do, but before I go anywhere, I want to make sure that everything I've got is, uh, relatively, uh, powered up. So where did Journeyman's and tools... Wait, where did all of my, um... Oh, did I pack those away? I might have done so. I might have screwed up a tiny bit. That's not good. No, wait, no, no, no. The Journeyman's tools are what I left with. I need to get some more tools. I don't want to have to repair them all the time. Uh, 96, 92, 96. They're not bad, so I suppose we could leave them. And wait, that means I probably shouldn't have used them. And should have waited until 40%. God damn it. Okay, well, never mind then. We have to move to the shrine and then uh, deal with what we have to deal with by, uh, well, by midnight, really. And a half minutes later. All right, we've reached the square where the shrine is and it's midnight. So we should be good for what we need to do. Now there is apparently like uh, Glad you're here. a method. Listen, we need to go for like certain conversations. Look good. I mean, it could use a bit of paint and spackle. I mean, it's a damn fortress. High walls, guards at the gate, armed men everywhere. We could never sneak in, and fighting our way in won't work. Menga would have had plenty of time to escape. What do you suggest? Take these shackles. Put them on me. You're gonna go in as a prisoner. Uh, Triss, sure you want to do this? Out here, with everyone watching? This might come as a surprise to you, but shackles do have uses outside of the bedroom. Aha. Uh -huh. Think. Bring the hunters the vile Triss Marigold. They won't just open the gate for you. They're likely to let you present her to Menga personally. No um. way. Too risky. Dandelion's life's on the line. Series two. No such thing as too risky. I mean, our life is turning into a big risk, really. All right. Fine. Let's say they take the bait. What then? We go in, I put a sword to Menga's throat and ask him where Dandelion is? That's probably not going to go work. well. Menga's scum, but you have to admit, death doesn't scare him. Always found that annoying in fanatics. So we got to trick him into talking. Any ideas? Oh, we'll have a way. Uh, Maybe tell him you have information about the Lodge. Or about Philippa. Even better, he hates her most of all. You'll think of something. Um... Okay, but first... Wait. I want to thank you. Come on. Anyone would do this. No. Not anyone. Stop. It doesn't befit a sorceress to blush. Okay, let's go. Still got a bad feeling about this. But tough. Let's go. Okay, let's hope that we can do this properly. Geralt, remember, I can take care of myself. You still you not locked about? up, though. The hunters. They won't treat me like a lady, but I'll survive. Might hurt a bit, but... Siri, she's what matters. Do what you need to do, no matter what happens. Can't promise that. No, we can't. I'm still asking you to. All right? Mm, all right. Okay, we're gonna put her in the handcuffs yet, or...? Okay, there she is. All right, apparently what do you there's want? like a... Here for my reward. On the Alpha. For a witch. Recognize who I got? It's Triss Marigold. Marigold? Come in then. Excellent. Okay, so the main thing we gotta do is not piss off the guards. Well, well. Triss Marigold. Giving up drowners for sorceresses. Pays better. It's cause they do more harm. 
What's a drowner do? Pull the odd fisherman from his boat, but the witches, they murder kings, scheme, start wars. Don't forget turning your cow's milk sour straight out of the udder. Ah! You're done jesting, Merigold. For good. Put her in a cell. Uh, I want to talk to Menge. Not so fast. I hand her over to Menge himself, or not at all. You reckon we don't know what to do with this witch? Let go, you bastard! Vulgar tongue's got no place being in such a pretty mouth. I guess we'll have to rip it out. Um, okay, what else do we have to say? Um, got something to offer Menge. Try to loosen it if I were you. Might learn something interesting. Mm. For instance... Okay, uh... For instance, where Philippa Eilhart's hiding. Yes. I'll get you for this, you... Shut your gob, ginger whore! And you spit it out! Where's Eilhart? I'll tell you, boss, no one else. Thought I made myself clear. I'll only talk to Menga. Menga don't talk to the likes of you. Well, then you be sure to tell him I came by with my friend Marigold. Fine, grab her and come with me. But be sure to stay right close. Okay, so now we need to follow the witch hunter. And he'll take us to Menga. We'll deal with the Here's where we split up. Go see Menga. Marigold will be next door. Okay. You can't have her until I get... You don't set the terms here. Dirk, you know what to do. What does he you know how to do? You word out of me. Not you, not him. Oh, play it tough, eh? Just you wait. We'll take a fingernail or three. That ought to get you singing. That didn't work for the last one. Uh, fine, take her. Do what you want. Come on, witch. Show you the wonders a pair of pliers can work. You'd be surprised. Okay, there is a way. There is a method of the dialogue. But at some point, we need to mess. We need to not only mess. Yeah, not only talk about the treasure, but screw up about finding I out about Dandelion. Let anyone in, unless they had information concerning Philippa Isleheart. This witcher says he's got just that. Anyone can climb that. We'll start with your pinky nail. Nah, let's go for your ring finger. This little piggy went to market. But it's not that easy to bring us Triss Merigold. Is that who I hear? Very well. I'll go see her shortly. You need to fix your roof. But first, let us talk. Sit. Sit. Yeah, why not? Have a drink, Witcher. Yeah. Yeah, why not? Sidarian. A 1261 vintage, year of the massacre of Sintra. How patient. Stop squirming. <laughs> this little piggy went home! <laughs> Kurt, please see why Miss Merigold squeals so convincingly. Perhaps she needs something. Hot irons, for instance. Speaking of metal, this goblet's silver. Making sure I'm not a Doppler. Ah, oh, it's immediately apparent. A professional. I find that refreshing. But to answer your question, one can never be too careful. Mm. You'd be surprised how many come here turn to rancid jelly as soon as they grip the goblet. Okay. Alright, um... So what do we get, sir? So, haven't been paid any silver sword in no other way. You hunt us a torturing Triss, but haven't been paid. Still haven't paid me for the witch. Yet your hunters are already torturing her. What of it? You're damaging goods you haven't paid for yet. This little piggy had roast beef. Oh, you bastard. No. This little piggy had none. Oh, oh, oh. I'm just trying to figure out where we're Don't going to be worry, asking the thing. You shan't leave empty-handed. 
I you shall sure pay about that? twice the usual reward for Marigold. Twice? Awfully generous. Why? Well, you've turned in your lover. The emotional trauma it must entail. You deserve compensation. Okay, um, which is do anything for gold? Don't know what to talk about. I changed my mind, let it go. Um, which is will do anything for gold or Triss betrayed me? Um, anything for gold? Yeah, I've plowed Triss. But what does it matter if you're paying gold for her head? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Nearly forgot the mutation strip witches of feelings. No, no more. Be brave, dear. Just one more fingernail, and we'll move on to the other half. You say they don't have emotions, but. Wait, wait, wait. Ow! Oh, bitch bit me. Oh, the bitch bites. Let's put a collar on her. Dimeritium ought to calm her down. You surprise me, Geralt. Perhaps we can deal after all. Okay. So, you know something about Philippa. This is probably well, when we'll be able to ask this it. information for free. What do you want in return? That's it. That's what we want. I'm looking for a treasure with Siggy Ruven's For this to work, I need to screw well, this up. Well, furthering the cause of the eternal fire on the one end, working for criminals on the other. I work for whoever pays me. Like a whore. More or less. Just offer a different range of services. Where's the treasure? Secure in a Kaviri bank. Far and safe from you. Far and safe from Ruvin. There we up. Got information about Philippa. Thought you might want to buy it. I do. But not at any price. Uh, free my friend Dandelion. There we go. Then it'll All screw right. up. So free Dandelion. <laughs> First you ask about a criminal's treasure. Now you want me to let loose a blaspheming degenerate. And here I add you for a man that is a being of some moral principle. No doubt we're cut from different cloth, but we don't have to agree on everything to make a deal. We need not agree any terms either. I could simply force you to tell me what you know about Philippa. And if we don't know anything? Doubt that. I really doubt that. Whereas I'm a man of great faith. Well. Guards! In here! Okay. There we go. More else. Okay, I'm not liking this. Oh, that's, uh, okay. We're stuck behind here for some reason. Get me over here. And there we go. Let's see what these ones. Okay, let's make this a little bit easier on ourselves. How are we doing with a steel weapon? Not bad. Um, we need to give ourselves a potion. Where's the hangman's venom? There we go. Can we now apply something? What can we apply on this thing? Okay, we've got odd sign chance to freeze. Uh, we can give ourselves... Oh, we can't, we can't perform that action during combat. Shit. Um... Let's give ourselves some good old-fashioned attack power. Oh boy, that's not good. That's not good at all. You know what? Maybe I should be, um... Maybe I should consider trying this again. Okay, let's try this again. Well, he's very powerful. Why the hell is he powerful? Oh, do we still have to deal with everything? 
Okay, this is not going good. Okay, he blocked that. You'll never learn. How is he not affected? Okay, I gotta give myself some more hangman's venom. Walking like hell. God damn it. Frick off. Alright, Tris, what are you going to say about this? Well? Anything? Still got a red dot that we haven't dealt with. Alright, I might as well just uh, collect what I can here. We probably weren't supposed to do this. Like, it didn't say anything about killing all of the, uh... All of the witch hunters. Alright, let's uh, explore as much as we can of this and then we'll go upstairs and maybe check, uh, wow. uh, maybe check Menga's little desk. A long time right there. Okay, maybe there's more that we have to defeat then. I did see some, yeah, uh, some red dots around, so maybe that might be them. So there's probably some more that we have to slice through. Wow. Yikes. Wait, so that was the only one. Ah, oh, God. Okay, um, is there anything else that we can pill for before we, uh... Like this? Old bear hide? Any of these barrels? Uh... No. What about stuff on the other side? I'm trapped. Okay. Already looked through you. Uh, nothing in here. Nothing on the outside, apparently. So all we have to do is move into here and then find Triss. It should be right at the desk. And she may find a key. I think that's all of them. That was close. What happened? I thought Menga took the bait. He did. Until I asked about the treasure. Geralt, we talked this over. You agreed. <sighs> Fine. Never mind. We should search the office. Maybe we can find some documents mentioning Dandelion. Hopefully. I'll search his body. You search the room. I'd start with the desk. Yes, that's what we were going to search. Okay. It's the only examinable bit here, so let's do it. Letter to Caleb Menge and Menge's Holy Tome. Uh, Caleb, I have new instructions regarding the organization of the next execution. Uh, we'll meet at the usual spot. Do not tell anyone where you're going and bring no one with you. Burn this letter after reading. That's probably how we'll find out about Dandelion, maybe? Property of Caleb Menge, blah, 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 blah. Find anything? Just his office key in his pockets. Here. Mm, nothing under his belt. Wait. Something sewn in the lining. Interesting. What is it? The key to a vault. 
Here, give it to Dijkstra with my regards. Found a letter from, uh, from a spy. I found a letter to Menga from someone important. A spy, I think. A spy? Take a look. This is probably how we'll find out. Drop boxes, secret signals. Yeah, strong stench of spycraft here. This agent could know more about Dandelion. Bet he does. Letter explains how to signal for a meeting. No mention of where it would take place. Hmm. Maybe Dijkstra can help. He knows everything. Everything? Slight exaggeration there. I'm not so sure. Uh, I kind of doubt the key will be enough. Key to a vault? No address? Why do I doubt this will make Dijkstra smile? Well, might keep him from setting his thugs on us. Breaking our legs for failing to fulfill our part of the bargain. Meaning glass is half full? Of something strong, I hope. Alright, let's get going. Alright, nothing left for us here. Let's go. Be glad to. Just not by way of the main gate. How are we actually even supposed to get out of this place? Find a way out of the witch's the witch hunter's outpost. Oh, that'll help. Alright, so what do we got down here then? Anything exact Okay. This is where we split up. But first, let's burn this shack down. Agreed. We've left too much evidence. Yeah, but I also need to blow off some steam. Fair enough. Listen, there's one other thing I wanted to talk about. But not here, and definitely not now. Come by later when you have a moment? I'd appreciate it. Sure. All right. We need to get out of here. Yeah, let's speed this up a little bit. How are we even getting out? Whoa. Okay. Um, okay, that'll have to be it. Any other examinables before we leave? I don't even know where the hell we're heading. How are we even getting out? Find a way out of the witch hunter's outpost. Or can I just, uh... Well, that didn't really do much. Did I see a... Oh, wait, maybe we can hop up here. Find a way out of the witch hunter's outpost. So just over... Tell Dijkstra what you've learned. Okay, so now we need to go over to Dijkstra. We need to tell him all about this stuff. He should be happy. We might be able to get this, uh... This little quest moving. Let me just see. Uh, what's over... What's over here? Can we even open this? Doesn't seem to be allowing us, so we just have to use our odd and get through that wall over there. I'll do it. Okay. Oh. You there! Mr. Roven wants a word! Good. That's what we came here for. Patient old bastard. What? Nothing. Let's just go. Be there soon. Will he automatically take us there? Okay, hopefully he's happy. Who do I spy? Why, it's Geralt of Rivia. <sighs> will you stop following me already? I will. As soon as you tell me where my treasure is. Okay, well we got some me info. And Menga didn't see eye to eye. How badly? Badly. I suppose that explains the smoke. My treasure's not in there, is it? Burning with the witch hunters. As far as we could see, no. No, your gold's in a Kaviri bank. Here's the key to the vault that holds it. <laughs> well, well. Would have earned yourself a medal if I was in a position to bestow it. That's fair enough. Um, no witticism in parting? That's all you're gonna say? No wry remark, no scintillating joke. <laughs> you want a knee slapper? Fine, I'll tell you one. Ready? You lied to me. Again. What? You knew from the start who robbed me, but you didn't deign to share that information with me. Well, we had our reasons. How do you find out? I asked the questions here. Not true. That was a statement. Come on, Dijkstra. This tough guy act. Doesn't work on me. We're both adults. Act like one. 
<laughs> ah, Geralt. I should have you strangled, but I like you, you bastard. I like you too, you count without a county. Now that we've professed our feelings for each other, how'd you figure it out? Since from the start, you were up to something. Oh, yeah? You didn't haggle about your pay. And then I heard from my sources that Margrave Henkel and Dandelion had rubbed elbows. Wasn't hard to connect the dots. Mm -hmm. And now, time to settle things. That a threat? Quite the contrary. You helped me, Witcher. So in spite of everything, you've earned your reward. Oh, goody. I take it you've still no idea what happened to Dandelion. We don't, unfortunately. No, found someone who might know, though. A spy, I guess. Signs his name, Yammerlack. Found a letter of his. Just one problem. It only details how to arrange a meeting with him. Makes no mention of where. A ruined house in far corners. Give the signal, and he'll show up there the same day, just before midnight. Just before. Thanks for your help. No need to thank me. Just paying off a debt. I always do, you know. Even to liars. We have and our the reasons. Final humble plea. Don't try to fool me again. Ever. All right, all right. Give you your fair dues. All right, so find a drop box using your witcher senses. Place the homely tome there to signal that you want to meet the spy. So how are we going to find it then? I might need to take a look at the inventory once more. Uh, quest items, uh, Menjuki, letter to Caleb Menge. Uh, place your holy tome in a drop box located in the column of the Eternal Fire Altar in the southwest corner of the bits. The southwest corner of the bits. It's a little bit too complicated for me to find out, so I may look at the guide to find out and we'll cut over there. Five minutes later. Okay, we're apparently reaching the area where we need to scan. Should be somewhere over here, maybe... Well, just get out of the way. Must be the drop box. Yes. Gave the signal. Spy should show up in far corners before midnight. Now, where were the far corners? Be at the arranged meeting place at midnight. Where is that? That is over here by the glory gate. All right, I'm gonna cut over there, and we shall do this whole midnight uh, conversing with the spy. All right, we're at the place that we need to be at a house. It's not midnight yet, but we will be able to uh, fix that by meditating. So let's meditate until 12. And let's uh, bring this on. Guess I'm just through here, we'll do. To hide and wait. Okay, be at the uh, find a good place to hide and wait for the spy. Where would that Behind be? Behind the door. Best place to hide. Classic. Okay. And then once it goes through, we can just kick the door down. Triss? How'd you know to... Ah, uh, Dijkstra, huh? None other. I couldn't resist. Really want to see this through to the end. Yeah, so do I. Perfect place for a tryst. With Triss. Mm-hmm. Ceilings collapsed, mold on the walls, mouse droppings in the corner, lips almost pucker on their own. Shh, he's coming, hide. Menge. Not quite. Indisposed. Very indisposed. But you're in deep. Shit right up to your nostrils. You're in deeper, I assure you. But answer our questions and we'll help you get out. Maybe. The answer to each question will be the same. Sod off. Uh... No way to talk to a lady. That's no way to talk to a lady. To a lady, I never. But to a witch. You can. Wouldn't recommend it, though. Oh my. Fuck off. I can take this. Really run at your scrote. You but I'm just getting started. <laughs> you must be thinking this can't possibly hurt any worse. Oh, it can. Um, should I be allowing this? I don't know if I should be allowing this. 
So, gonna talk? Uh, yes! Yes! You just tell me what the fuck about! Okay, uh, who do you work for? Pure curiosity. Who do you work for? Oh, say! No way! Sure about that? <laughs> See, that wasn't too hard, was it? We're looking for Dandelion. We know Menka captured him. Right. That's what this is all about. A fucking minstrel. Do you know? You might have set up at the start. Before you bloody started mucking my mind with magic. I can't believe it. For a miserable sap like that. Start talking. Get to the point. Dandelion is on Temple Isle, in the dungeon beneath the shrine. Menger's planning to execute him in Oxenford. Okay, there we go. Positively spectacular. Afraid you'll have to call off the show. How can we free Dandelion? Those who leave Temple Isle do so only on Menger's orders. Issued in person. Well, that's going to be Damn a bit it. difficult. We'll find a way. I have an idea. Tell you later. All right, we're done. Enough. We've learned everything we wanted to. Glad to hear it. Can I assume we can put this unfortunate incident behind us? Not so fast, Geralt. I know. He's seen too much. But why? I told you. I'll never. Either he dies, or I wipe his mind. You can wipe him. Strip him of his memory. But, but... But I helped you! I helped! It's not so bad, I promise. Peace, slay, and gave. Really showed you claws today. Is that how you see it? I'd put it differently. I showed how little I differ from these bastards. I... Let's finish up and leave. I want to go home babe and get drunk fair enough um I'll walk you home walk you home not today Geralt not today but there is one other thing I wanted to talk about yeah that little thing so mind coming by later Manga's dead true but that hardly marks the end of my troubles yeah uh, we can always stop by said you had an idea about freeing dandelion Yes. We know he's on the island. And he'll stay there until Menga orders him transferred to Oxenford, right? Which won't work mm. because we killed him. Problem is, Menga's dead. Doppler? So? No one else knows that. He could have escaped the fire. He could reappear. Him or someone very, very similar. A Doppler? Mm-hmm. Your old friend Dudu Biberveld impersonated the halfling merchant. Dandelion claimed he seemed more real than the original. So much so, Vivaldi gave him a loan of several thousand crowns without batting an eye. Hmm. Yeah, except Dudu's in hiding right now. Priscilla might know something, though. Fingers crossed. Okay, so we've got that little updated, and we do need to talk to, uh, apparently to Priscilla about this. However, we are really behind time. I really do need to stop this episode as quickly as I can. Even if it's the, like, the very little bit of the quest left, I'm gonna have to stop the episode right here. Alright, so we know where Dandelion is being held in the Temple Isles or something like that. And unfortunately, we need Menge to get him out, but Menge is dead. And in the next episode, we're gonna talk to someone who apparently knows the whereabouts of a certain Doppler who will be able to get us access into Temple Isle and get Dandelion out. So, thank you so much for stumbling onto one of the most average gaming channels out there. Like and subscribe for more if you enjoyed the video, check the corresponding playlist assuming something turns up, or one of the recommended that pops up below it. I am the Average Rook and I shall see you soon, for there is more average content coming your way!